This is Minnie. She is about a third of the size of her brothers and sisters. And I found all four of them on the side of the house near the road. And they all were sick and eyes were matted shut. And so I rescued them and their mom. And that was two and a half weeks ago. And they all were better within three to four days except for her. And we've done all of my holistic things that I've healed every single cat, every time of URIs, even UTIs, other things, but not her. I've tried everything. She's had two different long distance healers work on be working on her. I finally broke down, took her to the vet. She's been on antibiotics, but she's still not better. So she just does this weird thing when she's feeding that. She'll only eat formula from a dropper because she can't breathe out her nose, no matter what we do. Anyways, I did take her back to the vet today and they put her on an antiviral instead. And if she's not better in a couple of days, she's going to have to be hospitalized. Okay. I just feel so sorry for her. I've cried so many times. She just does not get better. We go in the steam shower every hour. We have a vaporizer on usually. Bad when you don't have a bigger dropper. I've tried her on a bottle, but she bit the end of the nipple off. And <laughs> it does look like, like I had to never wash her face, but I wash her face every hour. Her nose is probably sore. It's She's got a sinus infection now. <laughs> I don't know what else to do. Tried silver and silver for her eyes and Internally, she got worse. So she's so cute. She's so little. She's a minx rumpy. She's got no tail at all. See, she's so little. Hoping the kitten lady will help me. Never had a kitten hang on so long to this, like this. So her name's Minnie. Cause, ooh. Okay, well you're gonna choke yourself, little girl. So today she had, um, at the vet they put um, subcutaneous fluids in her and. What else they do? Oh, they gave her an antiviral, which I have to continue in the morning. Oops. And the two stray moms go get spayed in the morning. But for two weeks, I haven't hardly been able to get anything done because it's constant care with her. And she's like a two-year-old. She just wants to be held all the time. She already knows her name. She comes running and... Pick me up, pick me up. I don't know how I'll find a home for her after this. I spent so much sweat, blood, and tears and money.
NT sound awful. It's so sad. Kidding. And this uh, third type of eye of medicine. Tramycin didn't work. Silver made it worse. Eye drops didn't work. She was better for one day after I took her to the vet last time and played and even took bites of her kitty food. And it was so amazing and beautiful to see her playing like that. And all her brothers and sisters are almost fully weaned and they run around. They have so much energy and they play and attack each other. And struggling to breathe and wants to be held all the time. <laughs> I can't let her drink. I mean, I can, but when she drinks from a bowl, she inhales it, it in her lungs, like, and because she can't breathe out her nose. I guess that's why, but that's what she does. She just makes it worse. And it comes out her nose, which got, got enough going, coming out now. I'm trying to get, well, that wasn't very good. About done. I don't know, I want to force you. <laughs> Mimi, you're fun. Say hi. Oh, please. Well, Mimi, probably boring the viewers. It's been eight minutes already. You doing chills? She's see-through. Show them how you pull. Oh, you just didn't feel full. Look at my knee's got a big hole in it. It's got a big hole in it. It does. So she's falling asleep now, but every 20 seconds or so she gasps for air. See? Ugh, it just freaks me out. So she's had steam. She's had steam for 15 or 20 minutes before we had the bottle. She went every um, 20 seconds. Mm. Oh, Mimi. Yeah, my neck. Okay, my neck. <laughs> Help me. 